I'm Cadet First Class Grayson Ivan Galve Camado, 22 years old. Ating kilalanin ang Class Valedictorian ng PME Class 2022 na si Cadet First Class Kimado na tubong South Cotabato. At dahil tayo nakabisita muli sa ating alma mater, ibibida natin siya gamit ang video na pinablish ng PMA Facebook page. Tungayan natin ang kanyang kwento. I'm Cadet First Class Grayson Ivan Galve Camado, 22 years old, and I'm a proud Maki Damon and Tatak Marista from Kerndal City, South Cotabato. I am currently the staff for Education and Training Council of Hawk Company, wherein I am in charge of the activities to improve and train the cadets in order to improve them and develop them holistically. Honestly speaking, I didn't really expect to be one of the top performing cadets since I just wanted to do my best in everything that I do. But now that I am one of the top cadets in our class, I am very grateful that I have received these awards and that God has given me all the blessings in me. I wanted to enter the academy because I wanted to serve the country in the best of my ability. When I was a civilian, I have already served in different areas such as in community, in peace building, and in environment. However, I believe that I can maximize my potential and do the sacrifices in the best things through the academy. My guiding principle in life since I was a student before is that the highest medal is the medal that God will give in the judgment day. I believe that no amount of achievements and awards can replace the medal that God will give you when you already have reached the eternal life wherein He will bless you and will give you what you deserve for being a good and a selfless person you are during your life. For me, the greatest lesson that I have learned in the academy is to stand up again after falling. Life here in the academy has many challenges and obstacles and there are different factors that may bring you down and may turn your world around. However, life here in the academy will teach you how to be resilient and how to be strong in order for you to continue, continue doing your best and to continue surviving for you to achieve your goal. During the summer training, I was reported with an honor violation. Although I know in myself that I did not commit such violation, it made my morale low because I was accused of something that I did not do and I felt judged by the people that surround me and I felt that the whole world is turning against me. The times that you are on your lowest are the ones that will show you who your true friends are and who will support you through the end. To the cadet aspirants, I want you to continue to ignite the spark within your heart. As you enter the academy, there are many things and many challenges that will bring you down or may test you to the limits. However, do not forget your goals. Do not forget your passion. In times that they will hear my name, I want them to remember me as someone who did not give up. Despite all the challenges and all the downfalls of life, I want them to remember me as the one who continued to strive and do my best so that I could achieve my goals and dreams. To my parents, um, my relatives, friends, loved ones, and to all people who supported and inspired me, I want to thank all of you for being there throughout the journey of my cadetship. And I want to dedicate everything that I have and everything that I am to you. And I want also to thank especially God for bringing me to this moment of my life. At yun ang istorya ni Cadet Kemado, Class Valedictorian ng PME Class 2022. So sa mga related na videos, ugaliing tumutok at mag-subscribe sa ating channel, Tools TV. See ya!